again, the reason why the 10 yard split is going to be, but certainly that is going to be one of the more interesting scenarios to watch. Meanwhile, I mentioned Bijan Robinson expected to do everything here today and was the Bears brass looks on. He's one of the best interior offensive linemen in this draft. He play all three spots. The, you know, we talk about brokerage firms. How about the breakridge firm of Paris Johnson, The Ohio State University, Broderick Jones. To start our day. He played left tackle at Oregon. I think he might end up sliding inside and playing guard at the next level. Big dude running. Big man. Greatness. Here he goes. It's a good 10 time. That's a great 40 time. He should move pretty well. Big man, that's a good 10 time. Solid all the way around. Nick Broker. 184 10 there, 527. Goes for Broker, right? There you go. Am I right? There you go. Nicely done. He played inside and outside. Curtis McClendon, he is a large human being. Almost six foot six, 324 yeah. pounds out of UT Chattanooga with some long arms and Will wrestle you at the point of attack with his upper. This is one of the guys I really like here in Braden Daniels out of Utah. I think oh, he can nice play split. inside. Yeah, he's moving. Oh, that's a great 10. That's an impressive 40. And the four threes have tested well, and I think that's going to continue. He got a little high. Came out. I mean, the guy is almost 6'8. Blake Freeland from BYU, another gifted guy, but DJ. Duncan and Freeland both have some things to clean up, don't they? No doubt. And we see. has obviously been stupendous in his first couple of years with the Bucks. That's right at the target with the 174 and a sub five. Right tackle, right guard. Started 30 games his career at UCLA. He's moving. That's a great 10 time. Their season. Connor Galvin. I mean, the Cowboys are cover. He's plays just like a bulldog. He finishes every single snap. He can anchor down against power rushers. So he's going to get a shot, I think, to move. Uh, it's a good run there by Anton Harrison. Won the Joe Moore Award as the nation's top unit two years in a row. That's a smooth, easy run. Nice. That's a smooth. Ohio State Buckeye at the combine. It's unusual. And there he goes. Come on, Dewan. Yes. Back to the top. Back to the top. Eli Salt. A move I A little bit better time. Indeed. M-A-L. Let's just call him that. There you right? go. Steve Avila looks like he's moving faster than the first one. Right, right there. 1 8 okay. 4 10 split. Henry Baini Valu. The interior player is going to play guard. He runs a 5 5 flat 40. Guys. That's what he is. That's it. TJ Bass. Go, TJ. Stick with that first one. Flashes some power there. Rough and rugged Oregon Duck. That Earl, a lot of offensive line. Bostic Jr. trying to break five. Can he do it? <laughs> nice start. He's rolling. Ah, so close. <laughs> yes. Well, then what, what are they going to get off the register? Um, and... Just wild to see, again, as this is our 18th combine here at NFL. Really good one, C.J. Stroud, as D.J. mentioned, with a great throwing session yesterday. A lot of it has been really good, but the fact that we are now talking about Anthony Richardson, Josh Allen, similar, I would say, some stats, similar wonders about is there inconsistency, is there accuracy issues, but when you actually... Their <laughs> Blake Freeland's been the workout guy today with his nice jumps run. and a good run. We'll get you his time in a second. Second run for he's moving. Bruin. John gains the second. It's a good looking run. He gains one hundredth of a second. Is he done? Connor Galvin. 
Baylor. It's amazing the different running styles. You know, when you get the, the speed guys, the DBs and the receivers, they're, they're all so similar in how they run. Offensive line, you get a wide variety of, hey, of running looks. Probably like, really? 40 yards? Get out of here. <laughs> Yeah, that did look That's nicely done. Nicely done. Again, I think Wynn's got a chance to be a center. Almost cut a tenth of a second off. Harris, great time. Yeah, he's rolling. Yeah. He is rolling like it looks like a tight end running right there. Nice. Ryan Hayes. Ryan Hayes. Stick with the first time. That works. Broderick Jones. Number 17 on Daniel Jeremiah's top 50 list. He's got a chance to be the first one to go. He's got a chance to be the first offensive lineman in the draft. He's very much in that mix. And Dewan Jones back live here. Dewan Jones. Here he goes. He starts picking it up. Once he gets outside that 10, it takes him a second to get going. Then he's no one's waiting on you. No one's rushing on you. And that's what the combine is. The combine's all about hurry up and wait. I took my time and just got an absolute gallop in. And here's Tayshawn Manning of Kentucky. Again. Yeah. Well, he might someday. He, he said not, he said maybe never, but for can find himself a niche at one spot <laughs> and run that paper up as much as he possibly can. Jordan McFadden of Great Clemson. Ten. He had retainers. Nothing worked. And his mom, he told me his mom was uh, was ticked at him because he kept losing the retainers. Those are expensive, by the way. On Ojuku. Yep. John Ojuku of Boise State. Tough start. The left tackle there at Boise State. Strength coaches in, the, in all of college football. This dude can anchor all day long. All day long. And the thing that's crazy is when you're reading about him, people are saying late day two, early day three pick. Evaluation oh, by personnel don't guys. bash the and media, here, Daniel. We no, I'm just go. saying that's just what that's what awards are. Jared Patterson. If that were the case, the Hall of Fame would have every Heisman. Just don't talk about our meals or anything else while there's a Notre Dame personnel. Was beat up a little bit uh, this year, so I think you got to go back to see his best tape. Minnesota. Oh, 185 split. He had a really good senior bowl. He's he's going to the ball. There is a little bit of difference when you're justifying the snap count, and you can get out instead of that set hut. You can get on this. I want to ask you about Devin on Mike Mayock's. Did you just, he just Mayocked me. I'm sorry. Did I say that? Yes. Oh, shoot, Daniel. City so. I'm a city so guy on tape. Eastern Michigan. Oh, Washington County, huh? Five minutes away from Taylor the Lawan. greatest university in the United States. Yes. Taylor Lewan here along with Daniel Jeremiah. Ricky Stromberg is going to be a starting center. Promise? I uh, pink, <laughs> pinky promise right now. I'll uh, hit you right now. Yeah. Let's go, Titans. Osiris Torrance. Florida. He's not going to run a great time. But his game is all about power. Yeah. Tough to run a great time when your feet are two inches above. The yeah. But he has great film. He He's a fantastic. good player. He's played against some elite players. You see him in the Georgia game. Throw him in the phone booth. Right. No, one's missing. no one's winning. This guy had a great year. Switching from left tackle to right tackle was awesome at the Senior Bowl. Right tackle, plug and play, year one. That's such an underrated thing to do that a lot of guys can't, is play multiple positions or flip left to right side. By the way, would you would you be interested in playing right tackle? There is not, not only would I never play right tackle, if you guys, signed, if anybody here listening paid me to play right tackle, and I only yeah. play, I think I played 64 snaps yeah. in the season of 2022, <laughs> but I had a great time Did in the offseason. Did you enjoy that man. one? Yeah. Oh man, it was awesome. Tayshawn Manning. <laughs> Cody Mock. This is the heartthrob of this combine. Moving well. Yeah, Moving he's rolling. Well. Hefty fine. Hopefully he's drafted Hefty high. <laughs> Jordan McFadden. Get out. Oh. And we're going to update you on everything that's going down here at the Combine when we're not on the air. John Ojuku of Boise State preceded Olu Oluwatimi of Michigan. <laughs> Stick with that first time. Yep. Here's Good discussion, though, with Taylor about that. I think that's a great question. I think some people wonder about that. How can you right. win this award? But then what does that have to do? How does that correlate with your draft grade? Jared Patterson. Two consistent runs there for Patterson, who they rave about as a leader there at Notre Dame and his toughness as well. Nick Saldaveri. Saldaveri guy, Rich. Good. 
Play tackle, can play, I think, can play inside. 318 pounds. Really quick feet. John Michael Schmitz. His name is my name, too. Whenever he goes out, the people jump and shout. 5.36. Da 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 da. da. It is. <laughs> Juice Scruggs. Juice Scruggs, not only one of the best names in the draft, he's a pretty good player. His full name is Frederick Henry Scruggs. His dad named him Juice as a kid because he wouldn't drink milk. Thus, Juice. It's, a, it's an appropriate name. And here's your guy. Skaronsky again. My comp for him is Elijah Vera Tucker, who excellent in the Arizona State game. He's running well, man. But I would say the majority of teams, sorry, Rich, the majority of teams have him at guard versus Slater. I thought the majority of teams had him at.